New tonight, a cold case has been cracked. U.S. Marshals in Cleveland announced today they have solved a 52-year-old Cleveland bank robbery that captured the nation's attention for years. Will Uick was there for that announcement and joins us live. Will, what can you tell us about it? Yeah, you mentioned capture the nation's attention. There were documentaries. This was featured on America's Most Wanted. It sounds like a movie plot, and ironically, Russ, U.S. Marshals believe a movie plot is one of the reasons that it all happened. Ted Conrad was reportedly obsessed with a 1968 movie, The Thomas Crown Affair, about a millionaire businessman pulling off a bank robbery. Then in 1969, Conrad left his job at Society National Bank on Public Square, taking $215,000 in a paper bag with him and then vanishing. After more than 50 years, the U.S. Marshals finally tracked down Conrad, who was living in Massachusetts under the name Thomas Randell, only to find that he died in May of this year from lung cancer. Now, they don't believe he ever did anything like this again and instead was married in 82, had a daughter, and took up a pretty uneventful life near where that movie was actually filmed. From what I know about him and what I learned, he was a great family man. He was friends with the police in those areas. Um, and from my understanding, uh, even friends with federal agents in that area. So nobody knew his true identity. He was li literally the man living next door who nobody really knew. And the marshals used a combination of handwriting analysis, interviews, and other investigations to finally lead them to Conrad, who they say did give a deathbed confession to his family. More on this almost unbelievable story tonight at 11, Russ. A conclusion after 52 years. Yeah. Huh, interesting. All right, well, we'll see you at 11. Thanks.